to talk about business delegate design pattern. This pattern is directed towards reducing the coupling in between business services and the connected presentation tier and to hide the implementation details of the service. Business delegate acts as an adapter to invoke business objects from the presentation tier. This design pattern has multiple components such as a client that would have the presentation tier code such as UI, business delegate, that's an entry point class for client entities to provide access to business service method. Lookup service, lookup service object is responsible to get business implementation and provide business objects access to the business delegate object. Business service interface will be implemented by the concrete classes and then that will implement the actual business logic that is needed. Let's take an example here where we have a client that will have a business delegate reference and also the execute method. And in the business delegate class, we will have the service type and the process method that would use business lookup to get the execute method. And we'll have business service interface that will have that will be implemented by both SMS service and email service. So each of the service will implement the actual business logic and those two services would be implementing business service interface. And we have business delegate test class that will have main method. The main method will help us to execute the scenario. Let's build this example and see how it works. Let's open our Visual Studio code and create our first class called business service. Java. This would be an interface. Again, we will have public void execute method. And we will create our email service. Email service dot Java. This is a concrete class that implements business service. Here we will have override public void execute. Within this, we will have system dot out dot print line. We will have a statement executing email service. Similar to this, we will have one more service called SMS service.java that will implement business service and we will override our method public void execute print line executing SMS service. So this is our second service. Next, let us go ahead and create a lookup class that would be business lookup.java. Here we will have public business service. The written type would be business service. And here we would say get business service based on the type that we pass. So we'll check the type, type dot equals ignore case. And we would say SMS, then it would be It would be written new SMS service. Else we will return new email service. Let's give a semicolon here and create a new file called business delegate dot Java. So within this, let's create a private 
business lookup lookup service equals new business lookup let's create private business service that will have a business service let's create one more print a uh, private string type and we will have public void set type we will have type as argument this is a method and let's set this type this dot type equals type Within that, we have one more method, public void process that will have business service equals lookup service. Dot get business service. We will pass the type and then we will use the business service dot execute method that will execute it now let us create our client class client.java this will have business delegate we'll call business delegate We'll say public client. This is a constructor business delegate. Business delegate within this, we will say this dot business delegate equals business delegate. Similarly, we will create our process method process business delegate dot process so we have created our client let's create our new file and the final class called business delegate test dot java so within this we will have our main method we will create our business delegate business delegate equals new business delegate and we will say business delegate dot set type. So let us set the type as SMS. Let's create our client. Client equals new client. And we pass the business delegate object to the client constructor. And then we use client dot process. Again. We will use the same business delegate dot set type. This time we would pass email and we would use the same client dot process. So let's see what we have done here. Business delegate, business delegate object is created and we are setting the type as SMS and we are creating a client passing the business delegate to the client and again that reference is passed to the client and we are using client.process similarly we are setting the business delegate type to email and again calling the client process let's compile all these files java c asterisk dot java this will compile all the files now let us use business delegate test so if you see here, it has executed SMS service and also email service based on the delegate type. So in the first statement, when we set the type as SMS, the client that has processed is SMS service using SMS service. Similarly, if you pass email, client would be processing the email service. So this is a very basic example of business delegate. Hope this was helpful.
Thank you for watching.